Nature is angry. Deutschland sieht seine Verantwortung international und national. Rester dans l'accord de Paris et être pleinement en conformité avec ses objectifs. Our business community is stepping up with a climate leaders coalition that together. Welcome everyone. As an active leader uh, in the global dialogue on energy transition, Jinko Solar has always been committed uh, to bring awareness and drive action towards a just transition. So that's why today we are really excited to have with us Sam Kimmitz, the head of RE100. Welcome, Sam. Hi, Chiara. Thank you very much for that kind introduction and um, welcome to RE100 one year on, uh, coming up to your first anniversary. So just to tell you a little bit about, um, tell the audience a little bit about what RE100 is. Um, RE100 brings together the world's most influential companies committed to sourcing 100% renewable electricity for all of their operations worldwide. To date, 254 of the world's leading companies have made this commitment and they come from countries all around the world. Um, in fact, this year, the biggest growth area um, representing 40% of new RE100 members with the Asia Pacific region. And Jinko Solar um, really led the charge with a, a, an influx of new members from China. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much, Sam, for you, this introduction. Uh, so, my first question for you is what's the significance of Jinko Solar joining RE100 initiative for you? Jinko Solar joining RE100 is very important for a number of reasons. First of all, as a pioneer in China, just our third Chinese uh, member and the first uh, module uh, manufacturer to, uh, to join RE100. And uh, secondly, as, a, as a, a solar provider, solar module provider, this sends a really strong signal around the, the circular economy. Using renewable electricity to develop renewable electricity equipment is a wonderful circular story. It's a great example of how the economy should run. You know, all the inputs go into the outputs. It's, it's a beautiful circular story. Um, and, and I think thirdly is setting an example as, uh, as part of this, um, this really rapid growth of interest in RE100 in Asia. Um, Jinko Solar is setting a great example to your peers and to other companies in, in the region. Thank you, Sam. So, uh, here's my second question. Uh, as we can see, since Jinko Solar joined RE100, it has attracted the attention of other Chinese enterprises. And uh, what are your expectations from um, the Chinese enterprises? Well, first of all, of course, the expectation from our, of all RE100 members is to achieve 100% renewable electricity by the target date. And I'm delighted to see um, initiatives like the Abu Dhabi plant, which are achieve, not only achieving significant amounts of renewable for your operations, but also um, achieving extremely attractive um, returns and low electricity prices. So taking that tangible action towards 100% renewable electricity is really important. But it goes beyond that, and you know, webinars such as this are really important, spreading the word, raising awareness of, of you know, what you're doing and why you're doing it to other companies across China and across the world to say, you know, this movement is happening, the electricity, electricity transition to renewables is happening, and leading companies need to be on board. What other factors do you think that uh, can help encourage more and more companies to join RE100 and to drive actions towards a clean energy transition? There's increasing pressure from investors, shareholders, customers, etc., to show um, environmental value. And always the, the, the top reason for joining one, uh, RE100 is um, managing their environmental commitments. But increasingly, we're seeing economics coming in. Companies are telling us that they are joining RE100, are committing to 100% renewable electricity because they see it makes, it makes business sense to do so. On the other side, we ask governments to remove barriers to procurement of renewable electricity. 
it's no longer a case of, of asking for subsidy. Uh, renewables are in a fair market, one of the cheapest forms of, of or if not the cheapest form of electricity uh, that is available to available to a company. Thank you, thank you, Sam. Thanks again and so much for finding the time to have this talk with us. And uh, as climate change doesn't stop, we will continue to fight to for a more sustainable world, and we will keep building your trust in solar. So that's all from Jinko Solar. Goodbye. Thank you. We look forward to working with Jinko Solar in the coming years and on your journey.